<clears throat> then I'm gonna show you the Z bass line. Here's a sample of it. Okay, first thing you want to do is throw in, uh, I've seen a lot of tutorials, everyone's using Massive, I found a preset in Silent that I used, uh, that's not what I want, uh, go to the first preset, and I think it's number 50, 55, Hollow Tube. So you start with that sound. What I did was tweaked it a little bit. So I turn up the sustain on both A and B. Turn off the delay. Turn on the reverb. I like to have my reverb really short, so I turned up the pre-delay. And the size down. That's pretty much it. It's a good starting sound, but you can make it sound a lot better with effects on it. So the first thing I put was a sausage fattener. Next, I threw on a saturator. Where the hell is it? There we go. Turn up the drive to about. Around four. Turn on soft sign. And the dry wet down just a touch. Next thing I threw on was an EQ. Uh, boosted the low frequencies to about, actually leave it at 100 hertz, take up the gain to about 3 decibels, and the Q up just a touch, and then I wanted the high frequencies to come out, so I boosted that to about 4, and then turn the gain down to about 50, or the Q, sorry. Next thing I threw on was a compressor. Take the threshold down. I'm just going to play with the settings, try and copy what I'm doing. It's okay if the threshold is clipping there as long as the output is throw on a side chain so it'll take care of the clipping on the output. I usually put it on FF2 that way you get less popping noises <clears throat> if any. Next thing I threw on was I think it's a side chain compressor. Yeah so another side chain. Open up the sidechain envelope, link it to your kick drum. that's pretty much it. Um, if you're not getting the right sound, if you're getting too much, check your reverb because it's really sensitive when you have a saturator on there. I'll show you.
yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I'll show you what I have right now. I, I just made this mini pattern before I started this video. I'm just gonna drag it over. Another thing you can do is turn on, put on a bit of slide. Sometimes it doesn't sound so good with this preset, so don't put too much on. And yeah, that's my tutorial, so thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe and check out my Facebook page. Links will be in the description.